sits around seven mountains. Now, name me one religion that is surrounded by seven mountains. Any of them. Pick any, any religion. Think hard. <laughs> Starts with the C. <laughs> Catholic. Hey. Catholic. Bing! Not the Baptists, not the Methodists, not the Episcopalians, not the Jehovah's Witnesses, not the Mormons, not the Muslims, not the Buddhists, not any of them Hindus. Only one religion has seven mountains surrounding it. You think by now somebody is trying to tell somebody something, right? And if you tell somebody that's completely 100% Catholic, you know what they'll do? They'll just get mad at you. Amen? Amen. You would think, logically, they would go, oh, wow, I'm worshiping the wrong God. Mm -hmm. No! They get mm -hmm. mad at you. How mm -hmm. dare you tell me my religion is bad? They keep going, they keep going. Amen. Mm -hmm. And the Lord says, I'm a jealous God. I'm going to visit the iniquities of the fathers upon the children, third, fourth generation of them that hate me. You hate God, guess what? He says, I'm going to take it on you on your children, your great-grandchildren, your great-great-grandchildren, up to the fourth generation. I think he takes his stuff pretty seriously, don't you think? Amen. 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 But I'll show mercy to the thousands that love me and keep my commandments. If you don't bow down to Mary, or whatever statue, uh, I, I had a whole list one time of all the statues, of all the saints that you could pray to. I wanted the, the, the saint of boxes, amen? Because, you know, we sell boxes, so I said, I want the saint that, that, that you know, sells boxes, all right? There, there's got to be one there, but not we've got to make one, amen? I mean, <laughs> It, it just never happened. You know, so. But they have all kinds of saints. Hey, amen. amen. You don't believe me? Look up saints. List of saints. Uh, qualif you know, for each one. Verse number three. I mean, uh, verse seven. Thou shalt not take the name of the Lord thy God in vain. What does that mean? You know what it means. Don't make me say it. All right? Listen. You say, well, I can't help it. God be, what's the next word? Put your mother's name in it now. You gotta have to, if you're going to have to say it, all right, put your mother's name in it. Let's see how far you go there, big boy. Big girl, come on. Oh, we love to say the Lord's name in vain. And then unless it gets personal, amen. The preacher says, I gotta, I gotta damn my own my own mother now. Amen. I don't know if I can do that. Amen. Yeah, God says the same thing. I don't like it either. Mm. Just like your mama wouldn't like it. I don't like it either. Mm. Don't do it. Amen. Yeah. Amen. Remember the Sabbath day. Keep it holy. What are we doing? Mm. Why are we here on church on Sunday? We're keeping it holy. Keep it holy. Amen. See, you, you did pretty good. You got one right. Amen. That's good. That's good. Six days shall thy labor. Amen. Uh, that's uh, verse 5. Uh, the fifth commandment. Seven day, no work. Nobody works. The old timers back in the 50s, if you can believe this, are you ready for this? The wives would make two meals on Saturday. One to serve that day, and one put aside for Sunday. They'd have breakfast and lunch, and all they had to do was eat it. You say, why? Because back in the 50s, they really kept this thing seriously. Right. Now, we go to Waterburg. Amen? Mm. <coughs> Amen. Amen. I, I, I'm just saying the truth. Trust me. What we're still going to be open, even if we don't all go. Amen. Yeah. Amen. They're still going to be open. Yeah. Ha, ha, hallelujah. A amen. Amen. Right. Amen. But in the fifties, they kept this thing. They kept this commandment. Amen. There was at one point, I I, I was so religious. Johnny, I was so religious. I would not buy gas or buy. 
groceries if they sold liquor. Hmm. You know how many grocery stores sell liquor and, 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 and gas, you know? I mean, it's very hard to find a place that does not sell liquor and gas. Hmm. I mean, self-serve, they're gone. They're pretty much all, all history now. So, but you know, so that was just a religious thing that I had to go through to figure out what was important to God. Hmm. He said, are you buying the, you know, the groceries here because they sell the booze here? No, I'm buying it because the, the, the groceries are cheaper here. He said, go ahead and buy them. You ain't doing nothing wrong. I had to learn that. Now, if you want to get religious, you can. You can, you know, make your meals at home and the next day and can go get gas wherever they don't sell beer, all that other stuff, amen. If that's what you want to do, amen, you want to get religious, you want to get way out there, amen, you can. 